In this video, I'm going to show you how to do the child dress or duck walk test for meniscus tears in the knee. Get our very own assessment ebook and mobile app. Links are in the video description. Hi and welcome back to Physio Tutors. In the year 1957, Childress et al. described that isolated lesions of the posterior third of the medial meniscus are frequently overlooked and misdiagnosed, as the onset is indefinite, complaints are vague and variable, rarely produce a synovial reaction, and true locking is never present. Upon reviewing, he discovered that most of the patients had done work involving a squatting position or crouching down, which led him to the invention of the duck walk test. The duck walk test has now been validated by a study of Van der Post et al. in the year 2017, who found a sensitivity of 71% and a specificity of 39%. Although designed for the posterior meniscus, the test scored equal for anterior, posterior, medial and lateral tears in this study. However, due to its limited accuracy, its clinical value is rather weak. To perform the duck walk test, have your patient assume a full squat position. The patient is then asked to waddle back and forth and from side to side while in a squatting position without extending the knee very much. This position applies both a flexion and axial load and the patient actively rotates the tibia internally and externally during the waddle. This test is positive if the patient is not able to attain complete knee flexion due to pain at the posterior joint or by clicking at the posterior medial portion of the joint usually followed by discomfort. Childress mentioned that the clicking is fairly constant and produced in the last 10 to 20 degrees of flexion or during the early phase of extension from the full squatting position. Obviously, it cannot be performed by some patients, including senile, obese and arthritic patients. Furthermore, it would not be appropriate in patients in whom the McMurray test was already positive or where the patient was lacking full flexion due to its considerable compressive force. Alright, this was our video on the child dress or duck walk test. If you want to learn another test for meniscus lesions, watch our video on the Apley test. If you are interested in more content from us, check us out on Facebook, Instagram or on our website physiotutors.com. This was Kai for Physiotutors, I'll see you in the next video. Thanks a lot for watching, bye.